Hey, what's up guys? Fox Hunter here, and we have returned to T.O. Wara so I could build up my cash reserve. I burned through quite a bit of it trying to get that big albino uh, in my previous hunt video. And if you haven't checked that out, I highly recommend you do. There's a couple of things that came out of that video, uh, the first of which is uh, the results from the polls. Thank you so much for everybody who participated in the two polls I posted in the community section. Uh, and the fans have spoken and we are going to go ahead and stack the diamonds on this map. So far we have spawned in one extra diamond, a small rack level 9, and he can kind of linger and hang out for a little while. The other one is that uh, a decision has been made on Twiggy and I'm, I don't know how I feel about it. I'm both happy and sad, but uh, it seems Twiggy will be joining us in the lodge. And as I mentioned in my previous video, uh, we won't be just walking up and shooting him, we'll actually have a uh, make this a sporting thing. I'm gonna post a poll about what method you think I should use to harvest Twiggy with a couple of weapon selections. I'm thinking it's going to be a longbow, a rifle, a sidearm, and potentially a crossbow. So that'll give us a couple of options. I'm really curious to know what you all think I should use when I go to harvest Twiggy and replace the false Twiggy in the lodge. One thing I did get called out for on my last video was using the login logout technique to save my big albino from a poor shot that I made about halfway through. I accidentally released my shot when I drew back on him to get a look at him and shot him in the face and uh, he took off running and since I had worked so hard on him I went ahead and logged in logged out which as I understand it is an exploit that is highly discouraged among the community. So sometimes when I discover something that I feel is innocuous and I learned later that the community disapproves of it, it's definitely something that I don't want to do in my hunting. I want to have as much integrity as possible in all of my hunts. So if you ever see me do something like that, please, by all means, as long as you're respectful, call me out on it and I'll be happy to rectify the situation. And with that in mind, I'm gonna pose one more poll for everybody. And that is, should I keep the trophy and use it as a reminder of what not to do or since it was collected using that exploit, should I destroy the trophy? And if you select that, I will destroy it on camera. So let me know in the poll. Definitely curious. Um, and I will abide by your laws and wishes. Uh, definitely appreciate that you all come along with me. So go ahead and hit those polls, guys. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoy coming on the adventures with me, you know what to do. And I will catch you on our next one. Bye.